Do you load your creatine? Yes or no? Well, if you're gonna ask me that question, which you haven't, but I'm gonna I'm gonna pretend you did. <laughs> yes, it's a good question. With creatine, if you get the right maintenance level, and that's important. So a lot of people say, take with water, three grams a day. You know, I deal with 29 stone power lifters and I, I deal with nine stone boxers. Um, I get them both on creatine. Would three grams a day work for both of those people? Of course it wouldn't. So here's my golden rule. If you're training regularly and you're serious about your training, no matter what sport you're in, be it you male or female or whatever gender, creatine is amazing. Okay, creatine taken correctly and taken with the right quality of creatine does not make you watery, does not bloat you out, does not give you cramps and all the other myths that are around creatine. You know, creatine monohydrate, we do a micronized pharmaceutical grade 200 mesh creatine monohydrate. So that means it's 200 times smaller from its particle size. It's like the finest flour you can get. You can virtually see it evaporate when you open it. It mixes straight away. That gets into the blood system, gets into the muscle cells. So one gram of that for every 10 kilos you weigh, if you're training properly, every day. And it's not do five days on and two days off and all these gym rumors, or you've got a cycle creating. No, you don't. Absolutely not. So five grams a day, if you're 50 kilogram guy, a woman, 100 grams a day, uh, uh, 10 grams a day, if you're 100 kilos. So you, you, you go from there. That's your maintenance. Ideally, take it with some sort of carbohydrate drink, ideally, or a carbohydrate meal. Perfect. Now, do you cycle it? If you're taking it on your maintenance level, it'll take about 30 days to saturate your muscle cells. That is when it really kicks in. So give it about four weeks. If you do decide to, to um, load it, then go with between 20 and 30 grams a day for the first five days to really saturate your muscles really efficiently and really quickly. The one thing I will tell you though is on research that I've seen and studies that I've seen, after 12 weeks, the gains are about the same. So it's down to you. If you're impatient, absolutely, go and load it. And I'd go about 20 to 25 grams on the safe side, just get it into your system and then go to your maintenance dose. If you decide to look after your money, just do your maintenance dose, keep grinding, put it in. I tend to put it in like a, an orange juice or a, actually I put it in a Ribena. Uh, mix it up in that and I'll drink it through the day while I'm at shop and, and talking to, to um, athletes. So there's your creatine a monohydrate. We do the micronized creatine monohydrate, pharmaceutical grade. Not all creatines are the same. Try the never enough one. You won't be disappointed. Cheers, guys.